Next, I'm going to load the pieces up onto the lathe. The lathe has three washers. These washers are very, very, very important. You have to take care not to lose any of these three. If you lose any of these three, uh, the whole machine doesn't work and you can't make any pens. I'm going to loosen this up right here. I'm going to take two of the washers off. I'm going to load my wood on. Here's a piece that I already worked on earlier. Add another washer. Add my piece of wood that I just worked on. Add the last washer right here. And then add this um, screw at the end. All right. Make sure that this is tight at the end right here. Um, I want to make sure it's pretty tight on there. Now that everything's tightened, you can move this over, tighten this, turn this a few times to make sure that's really tight. Put my guide over. I'm going to tighten down the yellow handle. Now I'm ready to go. I'm going to grab my tool. It should always look like a smiley face, smiley face like that. Make sure I grab it with two hands. I can put my finger here and use it like so. Turn the machine on. It takes a few seconds for it to start. Now I can start turning down my wood. The idea, the idea is to go very slow so you don't actually break the wood. If it stops like that, just go ahead, turn the machine off, and tighten this a little bit more, and it should be fine. Once you get your wood down to about this diameter, you want to start going really, really slow because you don't want to actually break your wood. Let's turn it on. Give you an example. If you push too hard, you're going to actually break your wood and then you're going to have to start all over. So once you get your wood down to this point, just be very, very, very gentle as you turn down your wood even more because, again, you don't want to, your wood to break when you're almost done with your pen. And now that your pen is turned down, as you can see, I got a little too close right here and I actually went through my pen, which is not good. But this part over here is fine. I'm going to grab some sandpaper. I'm always going to start with the roughest sandpaper first. I'll tear that off or cut that off with some scissors. Move this out of the way and now I can start sanding my wood. Then I get another piece of sandpaper. This time I'm going to grab this one right here because it's the second, uh, next smoothest one and sand it more. And I'm going to continue doing this until I get to the smoothest sandpaper on the roll. Once I've sanded it down, I'm going to get some polish and just put a tiny, tiny bit on a napkin or paper towel, turn my machine on, and I'm going to polish it. And I'm going to keep doing it until it actually gets a little bit hot on my finger because this polish will set up with heat. And so as long as it heats up, the polish will actually take. pen's pretty much net, done now that it's polished. Now here's the important part. Remember I was talking about these three washers here. You got to be very careful when taking this all apart to put those three washers. Let me loosen this up. Back where you found them. Again, it's these three washers that are so important. If you lose them, then we won't be able to make more pens. I'll take this off, take the washers off, take my pen pieces off, take this washer off. So this washer's right here. I'm gonna immediately put these washers 
back on. If there's any washers, you got to put them right back on. And I'm going to screw this tight. That way, we don't lose any of these really important parts.